。嗨，各位同学好，欢迎来到 f o n e p h o n i x 自然音标。f o n e p h o n i x 自然音标的课程，今天老师要为你介绍是 Vocabulary of the Day。Vocabulary of the Day。而今天老师会介绍两个单词，啊，它是跟一些国家。还有一些跟一些啊历史的啊用到的名词哈、啊、有关哈、啊。OK， 那我们今天 There are two words for today, two vocabulary today, and I will be pronounce those two words. If you can pronounce, if you can spell those two words after pronunciations, please spell that. OK, let's go for the first word today. French, French. French. Second word of the day. Revolutionary. 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 Okay, I'm going to repeat one more time. The first word of the day. French. 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 Second one today, revolutionary, revolutionary, revolutionary. If you can spell those two words, please spell it out. If you cannot, I will give you more detail and the definition for those two words. Let's go to the first word, French, French, French. Definition French in English: adjective of or relating to friends or its people or language. Again, definition of French in English: adjective of or relating to friends or its people or language. Example sentences: There are no subtitles in any language, nor even French subtitles for the. Deaf or hard of hearing. Again, example sentences. There are no subtitles in any language, nor even French subtitles for the deaf or hard of hearing. Origins of French. O English, Francisque of Germanic origins from the base of Frank. One more time. The origins of France. All English France, Francis, or Germanic origin, from the base of Frank. Let's go to the second vocabulary. Second word of the day: revolutionary. 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 Definition of revolutionary in English. Adjective. Engage in or promoting polit political revolution. The Revolutionary Army. Again, definition of revolutionary in English. Adjective: engage in or promoting political revolution. The Revolutionary Army. More example sentences. Both forces style themselves as revolutionary armies on the Soviet model. More example sentences. Both forces forces style themselves as revolution armies on the Soviet model. Origins: Late Middle English from Old French. Or from late Latin revolution, from revolver, roll back, see revolve. Origins: late Middle English, from Old French, or from late Latin revolution, from revolver, roll back, see revolve. Okay. If you can spell those two words, please spell out. If you cannot, let's go to the lessons. 好的，不知道同学刚才有没有把这两个单词拼出来？我们来先来看一下。第一个单词叫做 French, F-R-E-N-C-H, French, 
French, French. Definition of French in English: adjective of or relating to France or its people or language. Example sentences: There are no subtitles in any language, nor even French subtitles for the deaf or hard of hearing. Origins: All English Francisque of Germanic origins, from the base of Frank. Let's go to the second word of the day: revolutionary, revolutionary, revolutionary. R e v e o l u t i o n a r y, revolutionary. Definition of re revolutionary in English: adjective, engage in or promoting political revolution, the revolution army. Ex more example sentences: Both forces style themselves. As revolution armies on the Soviet model. Origin: Late Middle English, from Old French, or from Late Latin, revolution, from revolver, brought back. See re revolve. 好的，那我们来看第一个单词，其实它不是很困难的一个单词，它是 French, F R E N C H. F R E N C H， 我们可以看到它的 onset。好，我们一开始的 onset 开头的这两个字哈，它是念 fro，fro，fro。那它最主要的哈，最主要的这个 nucleus， 啊，它的核音啊，母，它的母核音是在一、e、这个地方。然后注意看它的 coda， 啊，好，它的 coda 是三个字哦，哦，是 N C H， 它的 coda， 它的。啊，我们在讲它的尾音哈，啊，它的前置音首音是 f r， 它的尾音是 n c h， 所以你可以看到它是一用二啊，它是用一个二一三三的组合哈，一两个啊，两个开头的啊子音，一个开头的母音啊，三个啊结尾的尾音哈啊，所以它是一个二一三的组合哈，尤其是三个尾音的组合比较少见，所以我们来看它是 f r。E N C H， 我们看到 C H 刚好又是个 digraph， 啊，它又是个 digraph， 啊，所以 C H S H， 啊，所以 F R， 所以就念 fro， 啊，所以这个地方我们可以看它的母音的地方是 V 加 C 加 C 再加 C，vowel consonant consonant consonant， 那当然后面这两个 C 我们也可以当称它是一个 digraph， 啊 ，digraph consonant， 啊，所以它就是 C D C 了哈，啊，所以我们这时候还是一样。在 C H 地方，我们画二线两双线啊，因为它是二合音啊，所以在这地方降下来，好、啊，所以它是一个 V 加 C 啊，再加一个 D C 啊，所以 French 啊，再一遍 F R E N C H 啊，好，这样子过来哈，所以这样 French。啊，所以这是一个 short vowel on e， 啊啊，那再来第二个就比较难了 ，revolutionary， 啊，那这个字呢，我们可以看到它是 r e v 哈 ，interpong o interpong l u interpong t i o n interpong a r interpong， 所以你看它几个音节，一、二、三、四、五。Five interpunks, 啊，五个分音符号。Five interpunks, break, 啊 ，break, 啊 ，break into six syllables, 啊，所以五个分音符号啊，音节符号分成六个音节。所以那当然分成六个音节，我们就要注意它是第一个音节啊，有个次重音。第三个音节有个主重音，以及我们呃我们讲的这个最后这个啊、呃、这个音节哈 ，area 地方有一个次重音，好，再来一遍 r e v v o l r u t i o n a r r e r e v o l 
ru xian e ri。好，我们把中音符号放出来。所以第一个音节，我们可以看到，啊，它是开头的 onset， 啊，开头的 onset， 啊，在 r， 啊 ，nucleus， 啊 ，nucleus 在 e， 啊，所以这边啊，第一个第一个节的 coda 在 v， 所以这时候形成是。V 加 C， 所以念 ref， 啊，那这个这个第二个音节是次重音，所以 rever。那主重音呢？啊，主重音在第三个音节哈，所以我们看看它是一个用一个 vowel， 啊，它是用一个 vowel before syllable， 哈、啊、，vowel before interpol 的公式 ，vowel before interpol， 啊，所以这个就这个字就比较好玩 ，vowel before interpol， 啊，所以是。母音在音节符号前伸出长母音 ru， 啊，那在 t i 和弦还念 sh， 是个 digraph， 那 n 又在落母音 rusian， 好，那第三个音最后这个第啊，我们讲的一二啊三四五第五个音节这个地方哈，它又有一个次重音，所以我们看它是用一个三连音的公式 a r y 啊三连音，所以 a 念一个。破音字哈 ，variant a， 好，所以它是个 var，variant a adds short vowels e， 所以它念 every， 好，所以最后一个在落一音哈，所以这个字好，再一遍哈 ，revolution every。Revolution every， 再一遍 V 加 C ref， 好 V 加 C ref， w e v o w e l v r e v e l 啊 v o w e before v o w e before interpol l u 啊长母音 T I as digraph， 好然后 w e v o w e l Lucian， 啊，最后一个 tribe vowels 哈，啊，我们讲的 tribe sounds 啊，那第一个母音 a variant a as 什么 variant as short vowel e， 所以 ending y as long weak e， 所以合起来就念 a r y 啊，所以破音 a 念 a 的 e 的短母音，结尾 y 念念一个落长 e 音，好，所以再一遍 revolutionary。Revolutionary， 哦，所以这个比较困难一点哈，所以再一遍 ，French，French，French，Revolutionary，Revolutionary，Revolutionary， 好的，我们现在再来一遍，好，跟吴老师念一下哈，我们今天课文大概会念到，嗯，来看看，我们来看看哈，好，念到这边哈。At your mass, Bellerophon. Bellerophon was a 74-gun third-rate ship of the line of the Royal Navy. Launched in 1786, she and served mostly on blockade, blockade or convoy escort duties, known to sailors as the Beady Ruffian. She entered service on the outbreak of the French Revolution's Revolutionary Wars and took part in the glorious First of June fleet actions in 1793. Bellerophon narrowly escaped being captured by the French in 1795, save only by the bold actions of the squadron's commander, Vice Admiral. Quan Wallers， 好，我们再来一遍。这边老师念慢一点。HMS Bellerophon was a 74-gun third-rate ship of the line of the Royal Navy. Launched in 1786, she served most mostly on blockades or convoy escort duties. Known to sailors as the Beady Ruffian, she entered the service on the outbreak of the French Revolutionary Wars 
and took part in the glorious 1st of June fleet actions in 1793. Bellerophon narrowly escaped being captured by the French in 1795, saved only by the bold actions of the squadron's commander, Vice Admiral Cornwallis. Is that the vocabulary of the day? Thank you, everyone. Thank you.